Hey Cindy, it's Brody from Pacific Toyota in Cairns, just here to give you a quick virtual tour on our Kia Sorento. Uh, just before I jump into it, just a little bit about us. We are Pacific Toyota. Uh, we do have two used vehicle lots here in Cairns, one at 77 Mulgrave Road and the other just about two kilometres down the road at 235 Mulgrave Road. Uh, we also have two brand new dealerships, uh, one being Toyota and the other being Lexus of Cairns. Uh, without going too far into that, I'll jump straight into the Kia. Um, I'm just going to pop this bonnet here and we'll start under there. Obviously, just through this video, I will point out any nicks, scratches, dents, anything that's imperfections on the car. Um, if any of that is a worry to you at all, please let me know. And if you do decide to go ahead with the vehicle, we can obviously have them touched up. So as you can see, there's nothing wrong under the bonnet there with the firewall. Just coming straight through here. A little bit of corrosion there, but um, nothing to be afraid of there. Everything else looks really clean and tidy through there. Really clean. All right, pop that down. Just take you straight through the front bar. Yeah, there are a couple of little nicks here. So obviously, like I said, if they're a major concern to you, we can have them touched up. Just a couple of uh, stone chips there and a little, little mark there. Come straight through this front bar. Little stone chip there. A couple of little uh, stone chips along the front here, obviously. Just from probably rocks flicking up and, and hitting it there. A couple there as well. Coming straight through here. Let's quick look at our wheels. So, as you can see, there's a very minor scuff there on the wheels. Uh, plenty of tread left on the tyres, and really clean underneath. All right, this front guard here. There's nothing that I can really point out to you as any imperfections. Little, uh, just a seed or something there. It flicks straight off. Uh, mirrors all clean and tidy through there. Uh, I'll give you a quick look through the bonnet. A little stone chip on the edge here. And one here. A bit bright, so it might be a bit reflective on there. A little stone chip there. You can see that. And a very minor little scratch right there. Alright, straight through here. Coming up the top. As you can see, nothing that I can really point out. Did point out that stone chip just before. Uh, a little bit of dirt or grime there. Oh, it might be a little bit of a scratch, so that'll come straight off of the buff. Couple little, uh, no, it's just a bit of grime as well, same as that. Trying to be very pedantic for you so you know exactly what the car's like. But otherwise, that's really clean through there. Straight through the top here, nothing that I can really point out again. A very minor mark right there. Other than that, really clean. Obviously with this rear wheel, plenty of tread on the tires. No scuffs or anything that I can really show you through there. Coming around the back here, no real stone chips, a bit of dirt and grime there, bit of chip there. Uh, coming straight through the rear bar, nothing that I can see. Normally you'll see some stone chips along here or, or just some luggage marks, but nothing that I can really see there is a little chip right there. And straight through the back here little uh, it's just dirt as well comes straight off nothing through that one so through the boot nothing that I can see there either and to the top it's a very clean car through the paint as I can see so far it's just really the chips on that front bar um, just look through the boot here obviously a seven chair so so you got your 
tools and jack under there. Pop this rear seat up, just gotta pull that up. And obviously your sixth and seventh chair appear through there. Obviously both lock in like that. All right, jump straight through this side here. Nothing that I can really point out here, just a minor little scratch there. I don't know if we can see that, but otherwise, really clean. There is a bit of fading on top of the uh, sills here, as you can see through there. Come straight through the front here, and we'll start on this guard. Nothing that I can really point out, a very minor scratch there. Obviously, through this front wheel. No scuffs or anything that I can show you as well. Coming through here, as I can see, there's a, oh, there's a feather. Nothing that I can really point out to you through there. Uh, same here, I can see a little little nick there and here. Uh, well, on my finger. Um, that's all that I can really see through there as well. So pretty good all around outside the car. Um, interior. Normally you'll see some scratching and everything through the tops of these, but this car looks pretty clean of them anyway, so that's all good as well. Uh, rear seats, nothing that I can point out, no rips or scratches in there. Back to the seats are all good as well. And obviously your rear air vents there as well. Jump straight in the front and get this started up. So obviously as we are in Cairns, it does get a bit hot here. So it's always good to have some cold air con. So I'll kick that up and jump in the air con. All right, so as you can see, 76,012 kilometers. Does need some fuel put in it. So probably organized to go do that straight after this. Um, Obviously, steering wheel controls through there, and your cruise control bit on the right hand side of the steering wheel as well. Turn that aircon down so you can hear me, but obviously, you can uh, got that dual zone so you can control the passenger side aircon as well as the driver's side. Uh, so, straight through here, we can see, try and get the sun off it. We can see we got our traction control and lane departure warnings as well. There. I'll give you a quick look through the dash. Really clean, nothing that I can really point out in the interior. Uh, looks very tidy, so obviously got our auto handbrake, park brake, sorry, uh, and our gear stick. So, uh, quick look on that door card there, nothing that I can really point out either. I will just grab this service book out and go through that with you. So, obviously, 76,000 Ks. I'll just Put you down for a second while I go through and open this service book up. Alright, so as you can see through here, I'm just done a 15,000, 30,000, 48,000, 60,000, uh, and 74,000. So, full service history, all up to date. The next service will be due not until 90,000. So. As you can see there, or the ninth month, 2022. So, all sweet for servicing as well. Chuck that one away. All right, sweet as. Give you one last look around the car. Obviously, if there is anything that you're unhappy with that uh, is in the car, let us know so we can obviously have a look at um, resurrecting them for you um any questions about the vehicle please don't hesitate to just give me a phone call flick me a message about it and uh if there is anything else that i missed as well just let me know so i can um go over that again for you so no worries at all thank you for watching and uh yeah just give me a call if you need any more information